everybody. So I'm back with a tiny little haul. Um, as you know, this is all from the 99 cents store. Well, maybe you don't know, but now you know. Um, they have tons of Halloween candy that I've been seeing at Target for $2.99, $3.99 at 99 cents store this week. Like all the different um, candy corns. And they're big size. Like they're huge. So I picked up that and I really... I did not like that. I was expecting a Reese's peanut butter cup flavor. And to me, this is just whatever. I will eat it just because. And I'm not a huge apple fan, but I'm just like, I have to get that. How can I pass this up? It's like fall season. And this is actually pretty good. Like this is way better than this, which I didn't expect. Um, and the green apple I thought was going to be sour, but it's actually really good. So weird. Um, and then I could not decide because me and my boyfriend always go to Santa Monica Boulevard in Hollywood for Halloween. And I don't know what I was going to be. Last year I was uh, Miss Pac-Man. The year before I was a clown. The year before I was Day of the Dead. So this year I'm going to be a dead girl. Just straight up dead. So I'm going to do like a black prom dress with like blood dripping everywhere and like black white makeup. And yeah. So got some fake blood. And then they have these. Well, they had these. They had two. I picked up one. I should have got the other one. I, I don't know what I was thinking. And my other 99 cents store next to my house didn't have these at all. Um, it's weird. My 99 cents store by my house is like a block away. And the other one I walk to every day is two miles away. And they have completely different stuff. Like, completely. And sometimes, like, if this is here, uh, the two mile away one you know, like on a Monday, two weeks from now, I'll see it at the one next to my house. So I think the one next to my house either because it's a more busy 99 cent store because it's on a major street, they sell out quick or they stock slow. I'm not sure what it is, but yeah, I tried, there's five in a pack. I took out one and I used one last night. They work pretty good. It gives me enough just to do my whole head. And then, yeah, it felt good. Like the hair felt silky, like when you're rinsing it out. And then there's a ton of makeup right now at 99 cent store. And even though there was a lot of makeup last week, they've added new stuff. They added these um, Color Molten from Maybelline. I want to show you guys. Like, it is so... Like, I thought it was wet because it was just, like, such a pretty pigment. It feels wet, like a gel, but it's actually a powder. But it's, like, crazy pigmented. One swipe, like, bam. Yeah. It's really, like, crazy. And let me see. Like, it's pretty pigmented. And I got that one. It's a brown one. It's, like, dark brown and light brown. Then this is a black and gold. And this is, like, a dark purple and a gray, which I'm, like, Ooh, I think that gray is going to be so good. I love gray and gold eyeshadows. I'm supposed to wear gold because it says to wear gold if you have blue eyes, so it makes them pop, but I just love gray. Okay, and then I picked up this Maybelline. I don't know what it's called. It's like a little lip glossy gloss. It's really pretty, too. It's very pigmented. It doesn't last long, but you know, it's pretty. Um, and then I picked up this Master Glaze. Holy pigmentation. <laughs> okay. This is like some Bozo the Clown shit right here. So you're going to have to go light hand and like put it on a sponge and dab it on because it's really, really, really pigmented. They have like mauve colors and different colors. Let me show you on my hand. Um, yeah, that's one swipe. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I don't know. Like, you could, like, swatch it out and stuff, but that's one pigment. I've never, I never owned any of these because they were, like, $7, and I'm not really a blush cream person. I'm a powder person, so I decided to give this a try, and I was like, whoa, oh my, I don't know. That's going to be risky. Um, and then I picked up the NYC Sparkle Eye Dust. I have a copper one of these and a black one, and I'm obsessed it does f have a lot of fallout when you first take the wand out, but take the wand out and then like kind of like tap it off and then put it on because otherwise it'll be like fallout city, but it's really pretty and very pigmented. And then I picked up two of these, which I never owned any of these either because I think they were like eight or nine dollars and I'm not willing to spend eight or nine dollars for a lip product that's not a stain. Like I love the L'Oreal stains. I will buy those for 12 or 15 dollars, but these I'm like, no, but for 99 cents. 
I got 185 and 188. 188 is a beautiful coral peachy apricot color. I don't know if you can see it. And it, there's like a little, little no, it's, that's not a shimmery one. I'm like, no, that's not the shimmery one. And then this is like a mauve, which I think is more suitable for, oh yeah, that's a little shimmer in that one, uh, for fall. Like, to tone it down, because I'm usually a crazy bitch with my colors. More into reds and pinks and purples. But, you know, to for fall, you got to kind of, like, tone it down and go with the neutrals and just look beautiful. Okay. So that is my baby haul. I think that's all I got. That is, in fact, all I got. So, yes. Check out the makeup. There's a bunch of stuff. They also have, like, Maybelline foundation and Maybelline drop foundations. And then they have, like cosmetic brushes and a lot of baby lips and baby lip blushes which I haven't seen any baby lip blushes but I've seen them on Instagram people posting using the hashtag 99 cent store or 99 obsessed or don't sleep on the 99 there's a lot of hashtags for 99 cent store lucky 99er so yeah you could look up those hashtags and see what they have and yes that is all I love you guys and I will see you in the next haul